if you have been following my pregnancy journey from the beginning oh thank you so very much and today in here i'm putting up the video on how i actually delivered my child so these are the videos from my fourth weeks to to the nine uh to the top to nine weeks sorry guys so in here i was actually on labor but i didn't actually have the feeling but this morning in the morning time when i was taking shower i actually did panic on my private parts to wash it and i actually find out that yes i was bleeding the bleed was not actually coming out was not rushing it was just coming out bit by bit i said no let me go out so while I was in the market, I actually wanted to get some stuff there. I went to Banju. I said, let me get some stuff there. So while I went to the bathroom there, I wanted to ease myself. I still have the same symptoms. I saw blood coming out again. I said, no, this is quite crazy. I decided to call my driver. I said, please come. I think I'm having some kind of strange feelings in my body. I need to visit the hospital. So he came in, then we rushed. So this was we going to the hospital and from Banju, all the way from Banju, going down. The hospital where I actually registered for my internet, I was quite very far. So this is a Banju General Hospital. It's quite a very big hospital though, but that was not where I registered. So, uh, but here, when you come in here, you know that yes, yes, you went to Banju. So, but inside the car, I was so nervous, like, ah, hey, good. I hope nothing has happened because when I was one month, I got the same sign. But then, when I went to the hospital, the doctor told me there was no problem. That maybe sometimes it do happen at first early pregnancy. So, but he said I should just minimize. I know the kind of things I take. So I just took it as a minor thing. But when I still saw it again in the market, I knew that this is not just an ordinary. But I decided to go. Here, yeah, this is just a mini uh, National Assembly Banju. If you have been coming to Banju, I believe you'll be so familiar with this place. Look at it. Banju is quite a very beautiful place, though, if you haven't been there. So, here is the runabout. Banju's runabout. When you get here, you know that yes, you are in Banju. So, while I was still nervous, praying to God, I was not saying God. I just pray that it's just maybe normal signal like the way I have it at my early pregnancy. So, but here, this is the main national assembly. Hey, guys, if you get inside this place, uh, hey, you will know that, hmm, Banjul is really beautiful. It's a very beautiful country, though. Yes, yeah, Gambia. So we keep going. The hospital is quite very far from Banju. But tomorrow my prayers was taking God. I just pray it's just a minor thing. I don't want anything to happen to me nor my child. Please. So but I was just rushing saying, God, let me just go. Please help me. So uh, if you're not familiar with the Dainty Bridge, this is Gambian Dainty Bridge, one of the biggest river in the Gambia. It was it's a beautiful there are ships and boats in here. A lot of people catch fish in this place. So, hey, big, big, bigger fish, guy. So, here we are getting to the checkpoint. They made the immigration people and they asked for the documents. And then it was okay. We were late to pass. So, but I was still having some kind of little contraction while I was still inside the car. I was just feeling it. Was just <laughs> I got to the hospital, then I explained to the nurse who was counseling me that I think I'm seeing blood and she asked me what the problem is because they are not seeing the signs of labor on me. So I told them this morning I was seeing blood that I didn't understand. They said, well, even up tonight, I told them, yes, it was not rushing, but it was coming bit by bit. So they directed me to the doctor and the doctor came in and they told him the doctor said, it's an emergency. So they took me to the ICU room and then um, fixed me with the oxygen, got my prepared, dripped me off and then um, changed my dresses, put me on with this and was getting ready for, for me to deliver. It was a tough journey anyway, but I give God the glory. So as at this point now, I already start feeling the labor in me 
So it was coming and I was feeling the baby inside me. And to God be the glory, it ended in praise. So they didn't expect it anyway, but God was so miraculous to me. And that is my angel. She came out peacefully without any problem. The doctors were saying that I was so lucky that everything that covered her face was blood. But luckily, after she came out, she cried out. Look at her one day. Oh, baby. Look at how she looks. <laughs> she wasn't even like wanted to sleep on her bed. She just wanted to be very close to me, like just suck, suck, suck the whole day to the whole night. And they had to bring her very close to me right there. Wow, it was the very happiest day of my life. I was so happy, like seeing her that, is it really me? <laughs> Look at that, that was our first kiss though. <laughs> I was so happy and just, thank you, kindly subscribe to my channel guys.